For this next presentation, I'm going to teach you how to mobilize and manipulate the upper rib, which is naturally known as the first rib. The first rib could stay elevated, typically because of the scalene muscles. The anterior fibers and the mid fibers attached to the first rib, and if they are held in a short position, can hold the first rib up. They call it like a, an inspirated rib. And it can cause like thoracic outlet symptoms, um, ulnar nerve because of a, the lower connection to that first rib, as in CAT1 nerve root uh, makes up the ulnar nerve and that first rib could, could affect that. So this is one way to adjust. So now I tend to go from the, the head side, my patient is prone. So what we're going to do is find the level of C7, okay, which is typically the most prominent vertebra. Come on to what you think is T1, thoracic level number one. Come across to the first rib. And then what we're going to do is using the area of the pisiform, the mobilization is going to go towards the axilla like this. But then what I'm going to do is use the cervical spine just as a, as a fulcrum. I don't want to use it to thrust from, I just want to use it to stabilize. So when we do the rib, I use like a mnemonic. So we tend to side bend away and we rotate towards, okay? So we can rotate towards. Until I feel tension down, you can either come onto the C71 until you feel tension, or you can come over towards the first rib. So I tend to come down to this position, onto there, so using my Pisi form. So I'm gonna come over here, okay? And then technique is just mobilizing. So I'm using effort from this hand only, not using this hand to do any thrusting. This is just stabilizing. It's easier to say to the patient to take a deep breath in, please. And as I breathe out, I'm trying to use this Pisi form, mobilize the rib, okay? And I can literally thrust down through towards the axilla, okay? I'm not gonna use too much force on my patient. Um, this is just more for the demonstration. So you find the C71, you side bend away, you rotate towards down to the level. So you initiate a lock technique. Pisi form onto the first rib, mobilize through. Remember, always on the out breath. And then that's how you would adjust the first rib. And thank you for, for watching.